Hello everybody, welcome back to my craft room. Tonight I was planning in my happy planner and I was filming it and I looked up and my phone had died. So it didn't save and I lost my footage. So I had two plan with me scheduled for tonight, my week of January the 29th to February the 4th and I've done that kind of as a Franken plan using a few Mombi stickers, um, a part of a sheet of stickers from Blanket Planner. It was just some half boxes and date covers. And I just put the half box half boxes down the side and some of these little headers off of it. And I have I had a set of it was almost a full kit, but not quite. And it was from Trillia Planning. And it's these dark, rich, um, jewel-toned full boxes and headers and these half boxes that are down at the bottom here. So I'm not going to go into a lot of detail. I covered the red lines up in here that were for February. Because to me, this isn't February yet, it's still January, and I'm not ready for the sweetheart Valentine bit to happen yet. Um, I like this real good color combination. It's the golds and the purples and the blues and greens, and it's all the deep, dark jewel tones. But just as a bit of info, I got this kit from Trillia Planning, and these stickers... Um, let me see if I can find the other sheet. It should be here somewhere. There. There's a few left on this one too. Some flags and bits and pieces. But these stickers almost feel like velour. They are so rich and they peeled, a couple of them I put on Crooked and they peeled right back off. So a big thumbs up to Trillia Planning for the quality of her stickers. They're absolutely amazing. And I think I got this as a sale and it was just, um, it might have even been an oops. But I don't see anything wrong with it. So, um, yeah, I'll definitely be ordering from her again. Her stickers are awesome. So, I'll just recap what I did for the week. Um, I have a, a bit of running around to do, but I'm, I'm, I'm to the stage that my physiotherapy for my knee is going to be done this week. Tomorrow will be my last day, I believe. And then next week, I want to start going for a walk every day. Hopefully the weather is good enough. If not, I may have to find a place in town that I can walk indoors. And I want to try to put in, I want to start gradually and build my steps up every day. Um, I have to get back to work in a few weeks and I'm not going to be able to if I don't get some stamina built back up. So that's what this is for. I am going to count my steps every day and try to build up what I'm doing. As for the rest of it, my husband has been absolutely marvelous in taking care of me through my recovery. Um, he's been doing most of the housework. He's been cooking meals. He's been doing dishes. He's been doing laundry. And he's amazing. But the house does need a good deep clean now. So before I grocery shop on Monday, um, it's a clean out the fridge and clean the kitchen morning. And... On Tuesday, I'm going to do laundry, the towels, the sheets, the blankets, that type of stuff, and clean my laundry room. And then on Wednesday, I've got my entry and closet to do, clean that whole area. Um, it's not it's not a disaster, but yeah, I know the deep cleaning hasn't been done for a while. So, and then I will work my way through the rest of the week. That's the first part of the week, and that's all I'm worried about right now. I have a spot on here to put my most important purchase of the week so I don't forget it. 
um, my important event. And this little sticker is my call sticker because I'm terrible for keeping up with phone calls and the people that I should be keeping in contact with. And yeah, so this here is going to just be a reminder for me to make those calls each week and keep in touch with people. On Wednesday, I have to go visit my son because that's his day off and he's making arrangements to move to the other side of the country in about six weeks. And I'm on the countdown as to how long I'm going to be able to visit while he's that close. Um, I'm a little sad, but it is what it is. And that's all I have for my week. So except for I have to call the vet on Monday. Um, I, I really need to call her and find out if there's something I can do for my cat. Um, the one that you hear meowing at the door every once in a while is my kitten. And she is only about four, just a little over four months old. Um, she's crazy, wild, happy, and healthy. And we love her right to death. But we have an older cat and the last few months, she's been getting more and more sluggish and more and more tired. Like, granted, she's 18 plus, we think, and around 18, and she could be older than that. Um, and she does a lot of sleeping. Um, she gets up, she eats, she uses the box, she lays back down and goes to sleep. So I need to find out if there's something that I can give her to help her to find out whether she's in pain. I just need to find out. I need to find out if there's something I can do to give her a little bit of relief in her old age. Um, we would like to keep her with us as long as we can. She's been a big part of our life for a long, long time. So this is, this is done. I am going to put it back in here. goes right here because it goes right here oh I'm just gonna take that page right back out again watch and I'm going to take these out and I'm gonna move this aside and I am going to plan my February. Now, February can be a little bit um, more romantic. I don't typically do a lot of planning on my monthlies, but I do a little bit. And I have a few little heart stickers. I didn't buy a Valentine kit. For my monthly because I, I um well for one thing I don't think a person really needs a kit for this I glance at this I, I might put birthdays in here but they typically go on the page before um, this is a sheet from Mod Mode Designs. See, Mod Mode Designs from Etsy. And I ordered, when I was on her Etsy site, I ordered all of these little sheets, just single sheets. And she's got them for all her kits. They're just amazing, but they make a really good jumping off point for these monthly sheets. So, the hearts, like what can I say? It's so cute. Um, that's what I'm putting in here. So, I'm gonna stick that there. Isn't she pretty? Look, she's just gorgeous. It's like watercolor pastels. Oh, 
gorgeous, so pretty. Move it over a little wee bit because I want the 12 to show right there like that. And I am going to put her there. Right over here. Fourteenth is Valentine's Day, so I'm going to put this heart balloon right on, right on here like this. Put these little hearts around. I think they're better in groups. They're they're too tiny to just put a heart here and a heart there. So little groups of hearts like this. So stinking cute. Oh my goodness. This is such a cute little page. And I'll use every bit of it because I can spread it out on something like this. this phonograph that is so pretty There, and the whole sheet used up. I love it. Yeah, isn't that nice? So, these stickers, I just wanted to show them to you. I've had them for about a year now. I guess a little over a year now. But I was in my local drugstore one day, and they had these little stickers, and I thought they were so cute. So... I started off, I bought this little set of Charlie Brown stickers, and they're so adorable. I've used a ton of them, and I took them up to the till with my other purchases, and I got out to the car, and I didn't know how much they were going to cost, and I got out to my car, and I looked at the receipt, and I had paid 17 cents for these, so I went back in, because they had all these stickers, and they were all in the same place. So I went back in and I got a bunch of them and there were about 10 sheets of the stickers in the package for 17 cents. So I went back in and sure enough, these hearts, which are like the holographic, you know, the shiny and the owls with the little hearts for wings or the little, yeah, just the owls, the pink owls and the Charlie Brown stickers. And I think there were a few more, but I've used some of them up now. And they were all 17 cents a package. So just a heads up, you never know when your next big sale is going to come from. Keep your eyes open and the next bargain will just fall in your lap. So I believe... I like this little tiny wee sticker right here. Love this. And just do your thing. 
I'm trying to put the stickers down on days that I know I'm not going to write anything on. So that's it, I think. I am going to put this sticker down, not because it's a girl's weekend, but just because I absolutely love it. It's pink and any weekend could possibly be a girl's weekend. How's that? So there it is, it's done. Um, I'm going to go through and fill it out off camera. It's mostly just um, appointments and things like that. Um, but yeah, this is the page where things get written down as they come in through the month. And all of these stickers can be written over if I have to. So bye for now, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this. I'm sorry I lost the footage for my other weekly spread. Um, if you liked this video anyway, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, hit the subscribe button and have a great night. Take care. Stay warm. Be healthy. Bye-bye.